Oh, and well, you know, we're here in the next episode. We followed Vesa, like I said. A secret, but something terrible's happening. Hisui's in a whole world of danger hundreds of years ago. A being brought calamity to this region was sealed, sealed away by someone using strange mass magic. But the magic has come done, undone, the seal's broken. I hate to think what's going to happen at this. Right, please hear me out. Restore the broken seal. Just tell me what to do. Thank you. I knew you'd be willing to help. The odd keystone is for you. Keep it safe. Ooh. Oh, we're going to find a spirit tomb? So it was broken. A whole bunch of wisps scatter across Hisui. Hundreds. 107 of them in total. A keystone, you'll be able to gather them all. All right, nice. All right, so we have to gather the wisps, and we can get a, uh... Oh, there's one right there. How should she see that now? All right. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Oh. That's cool. That's cool. Damn, she just snuck up behind me. Call me directly if you need help finding remaining wisps. Wait here for you to carry out your search. Good luck, okay. Eerie apparitions of the night. The next day, alright. Let's see what we have to do now. So we're going to walk over here. Galaxy Team Hairdresser, dare I say, cutting edge. Oh, someone new. Hey, you're Mr. Chavry, the boy that uh, quelled Cleaver, aren't you? Uh, that's me, yeah. That's me. Alright, this is... You have quite the reputation. Oh, Sinnoh's almighty chosen one. Alright, who is this? I'm Erzu, by the way. Arzu, Erzu. I'm a warden of Diamond Clan. My special skill is haircuts. Really nice to meet you. Oh, snip! But I came here to talk to Mr. Komodo. See you around. Oh, okay. So, we have a mission from her. I don't know what the mission is, but... Oh! You're here. Rare wares are the best. Yeah, let's... let's... What can you buy? Ornberry, some just berries, basically. Medicine link. Iron bark tongue. Sword cap, bug wart. Okay, so just stuff. You do you have you still stuff? Okay, we got special product. Uh, berry. Nah, I'm not. I'm not interested in a nana berry. Oh, and there's a side mission is to give this guy a wormhole, so keep that in mind. It's an easy one to complete. And it's actually a good idea to talk to people because it doesn't, like, you don't have to go out of your way to do these missions. Some of them you can just do while you're doing your own thing. Um, do you think you could help me out with something? Sure. Here's the recipe. All right, what do I have to craft? Pokishi doll. Three logs of wood. Now I can do something with that wood that I've been finding. I did find wood, and I did put it in storage. But I only have one thing of wood, so I can't do anything with it. What is my satchel? My satchel still has five spaces. We'll go ahead and... Um, what is the mission now? That is the next mission, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Next mission is in here. Erzu's predicament. I'm just gonna hop right in there. Everyone's like, what's wrong with this guy? Good question. I don't know. Let's go up the stairs. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Do, 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 do. Whoop! Hi! Making an entrance. 
So, you, it's come to Ursaluna as well. This suggests that even Pokemon that are not nobles can become frenzied. I've received no word from Adamin or Irida, so it's something we can uh, we can simply ignore. In any case, you have my thanks, Miss Erizu. Uh, you did inform us of Ursaluna's situation. No problem, Adamin's got his hands full running our clan and all. Ursaluna's warden wouldn't even give me the time of day. Galaxy team are not the only ones I could turn to about. Or, okay, yeah, so... All the wardens, she is narrow-minded, bound by tradition. She likely does not take kindly to outsiders meddling in her affairs. Hi, I'm here. I have a new mission. Study Ursaluna in the Crimson Mile, and we unlocked a new area, guys. I'm excited. Next area. Oh, we'll find more Pokemon living there. Fearsome than the Obsidian uh, lands. Landscape is harsher, steep ravines, cliffs... Oh, welcoming. Uh, at your current rank, you should be able to handle it on your own. Here's what you need to know. Destination. It's a place within the Mirelands known as Solosian Ruins. Oh, I know that place. That's where you'll find the Solosian Ruins. Ah, oh, yeah. So we're going to uh, that one town. The one town where you breed Pokemon in Diamond and Pearl. That's where we're going. Everyone's like, why is this guy doing? He's just hopping around. I wonder if you come across other villages, because right now it's like, this is, hey, Akiri just, I, I jumped in front of her and then I ended up behind her. I have an itch to battle you. Oh, you're right, let's battle. Alright, so it's basically like your rival battles. Oh, she's got two Pokemon now. A uh, Pikachu and what? Mime Jr. Oh, well, that's cute. Uh, Ponyta, destroy that thing for me. And Flame Will. Flame Will is probably our best attack, anyway, with our physical attack. But yeah, this is the default spot where you stand, is right here. So it gives you the, um, illusion of, you know, the other Pokemon games. Because this is kind of the, uh, angle that you would see the battle at. All right. Ah, oh, Ponyta. Ah, oh, you always get knocked out, Ponyta. Come back. Um, Geodude. Yeah, you can't do anything to Geodude. You can actually stand in the way. <laughs> See? Okay, that's just funny. I was just doing it. Oh! I'm glad I got out of the way! <clears throat> oh, Geodude. Oh my gosh. That was like three in a row. Boom. And that's good. Pretty, pretty simple. You better heal my pony talk because it's falling behind, and this is your fault, Kari. All right, we got some stealth sprays. Ooh. Uh, you know the ones that are appearing here and there. I like to get hold of wonderful items. Uh, frightful, strong Pokemon too. If you plan to go into one, be careful about it. Oh, so there's like these weird um. Oh, we can go over here now. Look at that. That's over there by Solosian Ruins on the other side of the mountains. Nice. And look at this. You can already tell this is a... There's like some farmland, which in Diamond and Pearl, this is where all the farmland is. Uh, Poison-wielding Pokemon, plenty of others... And this is kind of like the Grand Marsh area, too, actually. Okay. 
The map will tell. Oh, space time distortions. Powerful Pokemon can appear. You're brave. You might be able to find rare Pokemon and items. It might be worth it if if we want to get some of that. Um, and you can actually talk to this guy. You can uh, trade out your Pokemon, and I might do that. I might go ahead and get a Scyther. I've got a level 13. Level no, that one's a little too high level. It's not going to listen to me, obviously. But um, um, we'll find something we can bring. Bring him a Chop, level 15, Rock Smash, Bullet Punch. Nice. What about this one? Level 15. Which one's got better attack? We're going to put them side by side. Easy to. This one's better attack, better all around. Uh, come with me. Uh, seems like there's a lot of ground types here, probably. But there might be a lot of rock types, too. We'll bring that one. Um, we might bring... Actually, that might be all that we bring. I do like... I do want to bring this one, though. Mr. Mime, give me some type, some some extra types that I can have access to. And Starly, we'll bring Starly. Um, yeah, Gastron doesn't listen enough for me to bring it. Um, how are we health-wise? Okay. Let's see what we got. We got Badoos here. Ooh, a Roserade would be nice. Alright. All right, go ahead and try to catch that again. Got a Badoo. Nice. Oh, and here's some Castor Fern. Pretty good. Oh, a Psyduck. And here's a bridge. Don't fall in there. We've already seen that we cannot swim. Or I've seen it off screen. Jesse actually thought she could swim. She fell in the water. Could not swim. We'll fight this Carnivine. Uh, Carnivine is not that great of a Pokemon, but I'm just going to get some experience off of it. Acid spray. Ah. We'll go ahead and do it again. Look at all that level up. Nice. Nice. All right. Go ahead and... Uh, oh. Go ahead and just run by that uh, Psyduck. I'm not interested in fighting him. Cricketot there. Um. Yeah, give me some of that apricorn. Another caster fern. Where is the map actually? It's up here. There's like some quest over here, but we need to go. Yeah, we're gonna go up there. Yeah, you gotta go in there. It seems like. I'll go ahead and throw something at this uh, Carnivine. It saw me, but it didn't see me. Ooh. Mm, sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. It's looking at me. Oh, it sees me. Bye. We'll be up here if you need me. Oh, what is this place? Or what do you say? A wild Pokemon lashing out you is move, dodge it out of the way. Okay. Well, is this going to be like booby trapped? Uh, I don't guess not. I'm just gonna walk up there. So who, who's got the bibberal? Who is this lady? Cabbage woman. I'm Calibur of the Pearl Clan. Warden Calibur to you. Ah, uh, you know, you have a celestial flute. Uh, uh, fell out of the space time rift. You must be. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. yeah. I see. I see. I've already heard about you. You that you quelled Cleaver and his frenzy. 
I'm sure people were saved by your actions, but I wonder if there wasn't something uh, something other way to handle that situation. What did what you did is harshly different from boiling a Pokemon in submission, after all. And you run about catching Pokemon in those little balls you carry. I don't need any help from you, your sort, or the Diamond Clan, for that matter. That young lady, Arazu, offered to help, but associating with the Diamond Clan, it just won't do. Be on your way. There is much I can do, and I prefer not to be distracted any further. Like walking to the wall. Okay. Look at me, I'm sad. That broke my heart. Oh, help me, Link. Show me how you frenzied. Okay. How you helped it. All right, Link. You and your togepi. I wonder if there's going to be like a like a like a like a big hint that it could be. Like, you know, maybe like a ponyta named Epona. What else would he have? A pig. Something pig related. Flame will that thing. Yeah, Ponyta's getting a lot of experience here. Boom! Nice. What's your last Pokemon? <clears throat> Gibble. Oh, those. Ah. Dude. Basically, it's all set and not shift anymore. Um. Oh, Bulldoze is a thing. We're going to go into Starly. Because I do not want to get hit with another Bulldoze. And that's obviously what this thing's idea is. Oh, Gust. Two hit KO. Yo, Twister actually does damage at this low level. Alright. Battle decided. Thank you, Link. That was a good battle. And everyone's level except Ponyta. Ponyta's always falling behind because it keeps getting knocked out. Let me heal your Pokemon. Uh now what? No, nah, well, now that settles it. I must ask your help in retrieving the stolen wall fragment. With your skill, it could be a cinch. Wall fa fragment? Exactly. Some bandits pillaged Solotian Rune and made off with a fragment of wall engravings. Totus misfortune. There are trio of bandits hit with the Ginkgo Guild a few times. I'm not the kind of regulars I'd like to have, let me tell you. Mrs. Cowell was doing everything she can to regain the fag fragment, but at 99 years old, wow, she's old. She'll never be able to. Let her sad. Uh, yeah, let's do it. <clears throat> because, you see, if we help her, maybe that will be what will let her... Let us meet the... Uh... Yeah, so where where's that at? Where is that at? That's up here in this corner. Okay. Well. I'm actually going to go ahead and evolve Starly since I can. Do it now. Do it now. Boom. Look at that. Staravia. Alright. We're gonna go ahead and just ride over there. We're gonna jump! Okay, are we even going the right way? No, we gotta go across the bridge. We'll go across this little bridge here. Whoop. Now we can go up in this little corner. Just going to ignore all the carnivines. Watch this. I'm going to jump over them. Hi, carnivine. Bye, carnivine. Oh, who's that? Don't know. I'm going to jump over it. It was a Paris. Those things are mean. They're mean when they shouldn't be mean. You know? Yeah, they're, like, mean, but they don't have any right to be mean. They're just... I don't know, I actually got macked around by one, even with a fire type. Someone must have been here. Thank you, Arceus, for telling me where they were. Who might you be? Not some traveler. Oh, here they are. There's one reason people go poking around here in the middle of nowhere. You're after us three, aren't you? Sisters, we should introduce ourselves before we 
show this fool how wrong he is to he could ever beat us. All right. I bring good luck to my sisters. I'm Charm. Charm Clover. And Coin. Huh. Basically, they're all good luck. That's, that's their theme. We're the Bandit Trio. Miss Fortune Sisters. Your looks ran out. It's like a... Come on, talk to Croak. Let's douse this full in poison. Um, okay. That's not great. It's like a full-on Toxicroak. I don't have anything, but... Wait, I've got Star Staravia! Okay, Ponyta, um... What level is that? 23, oh my gosh. Oh, it's raining too. Is that going to change anything? Uh, come, come back. I would like to uh, switch you out. I'll put Weasel out there. How about that? Yeah. Ponyta, I need you to be healthy, please. No shock. Okay. Quick attack. Just two quick attacks in there. We can hit two quick, quick attacks in quick succession. Okay. Staravia, it's your chance now. Gust. Nice. You know, levels up. Thank you, Ponyta. Move mastered. Ooh. All right, coin. Which one did we defeat? I wasn't... Oh, there's the wall fragment. Okay, I guess it don't matter which one I defeated. I defeated the one that's going to always bring Toxicroak. All right, tell me. Why are you seeking us out? Who's, what set you on this path? I wanted to help Caliba. I wanted to help... I wanted to help Caliba. Goodness, how selfless of you. That's so far away for the sake of another. All of us have luxury of offering such unthinkable kindness. I've got a score to settle with the Galaxy team. That includes you. Alright, that's nice. That's nice. Alright. I'm going to go hand this back to the old lady so Ursaluna will receive our help. We'll jump over oh, Paris. Run over, uh... Just... Let's go way over here. Where's the bridge? What happened to the bridge? I'm going the opposite direction of the bridge. Okay. There's the bridge. We'll sneak across the bridge. Hi, Carnivine. Nice to meet you, Carnivine. And we'll just ride in there on the back of a deer. We'll just hop right in there on the back of a deer. Got the fragment safe and sound. Uh, she she hates Diamond Clan or the Galaxy Team. Uh, we will calm Ursulina, don't you worry. I like Ursulina. Ursulina looks pretty cool. Right, here you go, Caliba. Slide that back into the wall so we can see Ursaluna. Oh, so you've come to bother me again. Well, come as often you'd like, but it won't change my mind. The wall fragment. What? You went and retrieved the fragment from those bandits? Why go out of your way like that for a complete stranger like me? I guess you're that eager to calm Ursaluna, hmm? That's right, that's right, that's all right, I am. I'll admit, I didn't expect anyone else to truly care for our Saluna. Well then, let's see that wall fragment. There it is, what does it say? Good as new. Oh, ooh, that is 
That is, that is that is unknown. All lives touch other. Is that what it says? Touch other. All lives touch other lives to operate some thing. A new and alive. Oh. Uh, Calibo is going to read it to us anyway. I went through all that trouble to, to, to decipher it. What's your name then, boy? I see, Mr. Chapry. Please lend me your strength so that we may help Usaluna. It's true that Usaluna has become enraged. But he doesn't seem to be in any other f frenzy. I think he will return to his normal state if we can give him some medicine. I could never bring myself to engage Pokemon in battle, but that's something I can rely on you for, am I right? Ursaluna prefers to stay in the Sludge Mound. Please join me when you're ready. Yes. When I'm ready. But I think this is a good place to just... Wait, where is the Sludge Mound? It's way down there. But we'll go ahead and... In this episode here, I think it'll be a good place to just report and then in the episode so we can see what kind of stuff we've got hey you're not the professor you're the professor i think you've got something stuck it's an unknown was that a pokemon i think of it volo did mention there were carvings that resembled writing to walls and solution ruins uh Suppose that the Pokemon saw a species of multiple forms, perhaps carvings, or actually likeness of this very Pokemon. I'm going to add a section specifically to your, of that for your Pokedex. Uh, 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 how do you know? How do you know about all these unknowns? Are you pretending you don't know, really, and then you do know? Press the Y button. I'm going to jump to the unknown research notes. Nice. Oh, yeah, on... Um, I would like to report my findings. I caught some Badoos. I didn't really catch much, did I? I thought I caught a Carnivine. Oh, I didn't. I didn't ca catch a Carnivine. Made some new observations. Yeah, I made some new ones, didn't I? What would you like to do now? Return to the village. Right to. With that, we've unlocked a whole another area i'm ready to find this ursaluna i'm ready to do some cool stuff like that but first let's go to our sleeping quarters this is a good end to this episode if you like this thumbs up subscribe i'll see you in the next pokemon video